Hi, so we'll be solving exercises related to uh, sorting and heap and we'll start with exercise one. So we need to build a max heap by adding uh, the values and then evaluate complexity. So we have this table, so we need to build the max heap and we should represent the heap obtained after the insertion of each element of T. So we have these elements and we need to uh, draw the tree for each insertion. So first we have it, uh, the number three. So three, this is the insertion of three. So this is the for the first element. And then we need to add five. So in order to add five, we, we should add it to the left. So we need to fill level by level. So this is not a max heap. So we percolate up and this is uh, the uh, final three, whatever we add five. And then we, we add one. So there's nothing that would change. So it, this is it. When we add 6 to the left of 3 here, so I need to percolate it up and then get down 5 and then percolate up 6. So we'll end with this. And then we have 8. So 8, I should place it here. However, I cannot, uh, I should percolate it up. So I will get 8 here. 1, 6, 5, and 3. And then we should add 11, so 11 it would be on the left of 1. So again, I would percolate it up, so 11, the left part would remain the same. And then we have 8 here and 1. And then we will add uh, 2, so adding 2 to the right of 8, so nothing changes here. And then uh, what we should add, so we add 4, so 4 it would be on the left of 3, so uh, I need to uh, percolate it up, so 11, 6, so on the right side nothing changes, so here I have 4, 5, and 3, and then I have 9 here, so I would percolate it up until 6, so 11 on the right side, Everything remains the same. Then I have 9. On the right part, everything is the same. On the left part, I have 6, 3, and 4. And then I should add 10. So 10, it would be on the left of uh, 5. So let me draw it here. So I would percolate it up. So on the right side, nothing would change. Here, I would have a 10. On the left side, Again, nothing changes. Here I would have 9, and on the left part, I uh, would have a 5. So this is the, the uh, tree. So, uh, uh, and then uh, we are asked to, so, to add the uh, value 13 to the above hip, and we should represent all the iterations. So we have this, and we need to add 13. So I will add 13 here. So 13 here, so the, 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 the heap is not a max heap, so I should percolate the 13 up. So uh, I would end with 11. On the right side, everything is the same. I have 10 here. On the left side, everything the same. However, here I should have 13. And here 9. And 5 remains the same. So now I, I should percolate up 13. So... Again, on the right side here, everything is the same. Here I would have 13. So on the left side, nothing would change. So here, the 10 would uh, percolate down, 5 and 9. So now, again, I need to percolate up uh, 13. So 13 would be up. On the right side, again, nothing changes. Here I would have 11. And everything here is the same. So this is the tree after inserting the element 13. And then represent the heap above obtained in the form of, a, of an array of a table. So it's very easy. So it's 13, 11, 8, 6, 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 9. So this is the array 13, 11, 8, 6, 10, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 9. So I, I, I just read the element row uh, level by level. So they are asking us give the worst time complexity of searching the maximum element. So if you have this uh, heap, how many instructions do you need to find the maximum? So obviously it's here, just 
one operation I just need to check the element of index 0 and give the words time complexity of searching the minimum element so the minimum element is one of the uh, leaf nodes so it's either 1, uh, 2, 3, 4, 5 and 9 so if I look well here it's one of these elements so the number of elements here is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 and the number of elements here is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 so whenever I want to, to check the element and if the array here it contains 13 elements so I need to check uh, or 11 elements so I need to check at most n over 2 elements because I need to check at least half of uh, the array so and this is the answer so it's the complexity is around n over 2 uh, uh, and where n is the number of elements in the array so this is the answer for this question for exercise 1 so if you have any questions do not hesitate to write to me and I will answer you back and again thanks for watching